Hey guys, uh, today I'm going to be making a toilet roll holder. Um, I know what you're thinking, why? Uh, but basically, yeah, my kids knocked this off. Um, I have no idea how, but it's even got the wall plug in it. So they've done a good job there, uh, and I thought make a better one, basically. And yeah, I'm going to do a Space Invader one. Uh, so I went online, got my reference images, chose which one I wanted to use, uh, drawn it out. Each block, I've measured it for uh, one inch square. These parts up here, because they're connected there, going to be a bit difficult to um, to actually manage the cut out. They they will not support themselves. So what what I'm thinking of doing is just adding a, just an extra little corner there, just to, so it holds it. Um, but yeah, that should work. And um, there's one down here as well. And yeah, the slightly changing it a bit, but you get the idea. And down there, uh, I will put these plans available in the description below for you to copy if you want. I've drawn my little design out, three quarter inch MDF. I just stick that on there. You can either use a jigsaw, bandsaw, or scroll saw, cut that out. With this, I've had to do a little bit of measurement. So yeah, with that, measure, because it's got to come out. So that's like two and a half. And that'll be coming out here. So it looks like it's coming out of his mouth, the toilet roll. Which would be pretty cool. And measure the size of it. Uh, that's just five and a quarter. So, yep, that's about the. So yeah, we just need to make four brackets here to come out, either side. Essentially, this this is the only thing we want from that. So that could be chucked or recycled somehow. But yeah, measure that and we'll get that in there somehow. So I'll get chopping this up and. See, take it from there. Okay, so that's all cut out. That's taken me about half an hour. Uh, so, yeah, it's looking good. Uh, I was right to do these. They look better. Get a better look at it. And yeah, it turned out alright. Uh, just need to clean it up. These rough edges, give them a bit of a sand down. See if I can sh straighten up these edges a bit better. Okay, so I've got it all cleaned up. Uh, it's looking loads better now, nice and tidy. Uh, you can see I've drawn out the mounts that are going on either side. I just need to cut those out now. Um, I've marked out the center point from from this edge to here. It needs to be two and a half inches. Okay, so that's the uh, mount bits cut out. So I'll clean these up, sand them down, and get them mounted. 
And there we have it, guys. One Space Invaders toilet roll holder. Awesome, eh? Uh, as you see, I've got two screws in there. All nice and flushed in, so it doesn't bulk out the off the wall. I use some is it P yeah PVA glue, uh, as well as two bolts for each. And yeah, it looks awesome. Just need to paint it now. I think I might just paint it black or a nice big bright colour. I'm not sure yet. But yeah. I'll get that painted and put on the wall. Okay, so there it is, guys. You can see I painted it green. Uh, I thought green was, would be the best option. And yeah, I think it turned out pretty well. It's uh, pretty cool. Uh, got this thing fixed in. That just literally pops out like that. You can put your new Luo on it. And yeah, it's ace. Just need to make a couple of drill holes now for mounting it onto the wall. Okay, so there it is guys, all mounted up, ready to go. That's how I created a Space Invaders toilet roll holder. <laughs> uh, yeah, if you want to try it yourself, as I say, I'll put the plans in the description below. Everything you need to know, all the materials and what have you. Um, and yeah, thanks for watching.